So today we've got the 1986 opus, Armor of God, which to date is still my favorite Jackie Chan film because it's just, it's balls to the wall. Awesome 80s, crazy Hong Kong. Crazy Hong Kong. Right, Golden Harvest. Golden Harvest, here we go. So what's it about? Okay, so in this movie, Jackie is a treasure hunter known as the Asian Hawk who travels the world collecting bits and pieces. He's basically Indiana Jones, but with more racial stereotypes. He can speak speak native. <laughs> it opens with a uh, a pretty mad action beat. Jackie actually cracked his skull open for this one. <laughs> That's dedication. And a lack of health and safety. Well, look at all them. The, they're all sliding down the hill on their fucking shields. <laughs> 40 million miles an hour. No, you just know at the bottom of that was a big pile of stuntmen. <laughs> Get on with the story then. But yes, he's travelled about and in this he is um, contracted to find the remaining pieces of the armour of God. There's five, there's five pieces, all up and Collector has three. And the other two are held by a strange cult. The collector who is apparently an earlier version of Matt Berry. Mm. <laughs> you really think I would be interested in money? <laughs> well, it's basically Jackie and his sidekick. Jackie and his sidekicks. His Jackie friend Alan, who they were in a band together yeah. before this called The Losers. We grew up together, played the same games, dated Laura. We're just like brothers. How can you treat me like a stranger? Have you forgotten? As boys, you always bullied me. Said my singing voice was no good. And you had lots of cash to spend on Laura when we're dating her. You never treated me as a friend. And the collector's daughter. <laughs> What's the matter? It's a sexy car. But the wind will mess up my hair. Because the, the bad, the cult up in Yugoslavia or somewhere have kidnapped their ex. Mm. And they've kidnapped her so that they will go and try and save her and bring the other pieces of mm. the the armor one thing you will notice about this movie i mean it has once again the sound effects but the stunts are bigger and the action pieces are faster, faster editing and, and really and cut the around movements are much faster like there's yeah. the car chase sequence when they first get to europe there's one bit where the truck comes off the top of the stairs The camera is in a car driving past it, and it's it's this far away. Yeah, and who sponsored uh, this car? I think this car's made by Mitsubishi, but I'm not How can sure. You tell? I'm not sure. I think there's a logo on the front of it. And the Jackie Mobile is a concept car that mm, you would never drive anyway, <laughs> even with its little getaway bit and self-destruct system. Hey, 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 Jackie, you were great. Lucky you got this car. I take it everywhere with me. Once again, we have some incredible dubbing. Yeah, you've got your standard, ex- as expected, dubbing. Mm. But there's one particular character <laughs> where they've really exaggerated how the actor acted and they've really taken it to a new level with the dubbing, and it's the waiter. Three beers, please. Okay, coming up, sir. I mean, the acting camp, you sort of hear the voice camp is just another level. 900 denarii for the beers. There, keep the change. Thank you. Because you also have a DVD copy. I, I, I did And buy the dub this. is different, right? Yeah, and, and it's not as extreme. It's not as no. over the top. But I, I actually gave away the DVD because the DVD didn't have this voice dub on it. Can I ask you something? Mm-hmm. Bit of money for your trouble. <laughs> My answers are too expensive for you. Uh, how expensive? Mm-hmm. Oh, 100 US dollars. I would have loved to have seen the recording session for this. <laughs> yeah. Oh, every Monday they come into town to buy food, and when they leave, they take some girls with them. What girls? Wait, don't answer that question. It's talking about outdated. Jackie's, the way he acts to women in yeah, this. Yeah, the sexism. The sexism in this is unbelievable. Don't forget that I'm coming too. Don't give me that look. Women aren't entirely useless. I came second in the European pistol shoot. You'll be all right if I'm with you. <laughs> hmm. Tell me something. In that competition, were there only two women? Hey! Shoot him! Shoot him quick! 
You must be mad. I told you women are useless. She'll kill us both. It's gonna cost me. <laughs> and then later on, she declares, You're no hooker. Oh, yes, yes, I am. Believe me. No, you're not. You're lying. No, I'm a real prostitute. A low class slut. The main cult leader. Uh, he's so weird. Wow. Looking. He's a Mortal Kombat character. <laughs> What's with the. Yeah, he's got the. Weird. He's the mo, the hair, and happy hour. It is now happy hour. Yes! Wait, brothers, you must observe your duties well. Go forth and multiply. I was thinking, where, where do I join up for this cult? I oh, it's one hell of a cult. <laughs> no one's ever picked up that the religious monks come down and pick up a whole bunch of hookers at the end of the week and take them up to the mountain. Why would they have to take them back? Wouldn't it be a standing booking? Yeah, they should just go it's off. Just... But who's paying for all these hookers? All right, beside the point. Stop it! You can't do this to me. So this is pretty much the epitome of one of those crazy Hong Kong use the set. You know, yeah, it's, it's not traditional weapons. He just no, finds it's whatever he can get his hands on. Things in in the scene. A couple of plates and food. Yeah. A giant log. <laughs> but he somehow lights on fire with wine. Would wine? I don't think wine has enough alcohol I don't to think burn wine it, burns. does it? You know, I don't think spirits. I why would you waste wine trying to burn it? See what I mean? It's yeah, got it's that. The classic Hong and Kong it's fast. I, I can never work out if these things are sped up or not. It doesn't really look doesn't I think look it's just it. the editing and the fast like he's yeah, hand movement. This sort of action long before Hollywood really picked up on this frantic, really fast action, you can still see what's going on more in this than a lot of the Hollywood style. Because oh, yeah. Hollywood they would be cutting quickly plus shaking the camera too much and mm, oh, especially these uh, days. And it, it this really looks like they're doing it. So, you're the Asian hawk. Correct. So the actual main boss, sort of Ming the Merciless type, he comes yeah, out. Yeah, here comes Ming. More exaggerated look. But then he has a, an ace up his sleeve. And I don't know where he managed to find women like this in Europe who fight in high heels. It seems to be their downfall. But Their Achilles heel I is have, their but, high I, heels. but this is one of those fights. Once again, it's fast, it's furious, yeah. and, and it's painful. <laughs> This is what you do a lot when you're watching these movies for the first time is, ah! Oh! Is this the bit where she falls over the balcony and lands oh, on her head? Oh! Ow! He finds himself on a very sort of Indiana Jones, Temple of Doom type ledge. Mm-hmm. And what's and the land. only solution is to mm. jump off a cliff. And land on a hot air balloon. And land on, well, what else? Yeah. Surely. See this, they're trying to steer the balloon closer. <laughs> I don't know how they're supposed to. They're saying, get closer, get closer. It's like, yeah, that's not how that yeah, works. Yeah, that's not how it works. <laughs> not to mention they obviously filmed it in a car park or something because there's a tree <laughs> there's in the bottom right the of the screen. Bottom. I mean, that's pretty much the end. And that, which you get bloopers and behind the scenes stuff. Behind the a, scenes, primarily an, of his accident. Of his accident and to a rockin' 80s song performed by Jackie himself. From the losers, no, no doubt. You cannot go wrong with Armour of God, I reckon. No. Well, 1986, right in the mid right 80s. In before Ock Health and Safety came along and went, no, Hong no, Kong, no, no, you can't do that. Jackie mm. Chan, nuts action, and in this case on VHS. And it's the only way to see it if you can find that. That's an X rental, too. This is an X rental. I, uh, this will be down to the grand kitties. It's a great yeah. artwork. It's that hand drawn. Yeah. The hand drawn artwork that makes everyone look a lot cooler than they are actually mm. in the film. We caught it on an audio hi-fi system. We caught it on an audio hi-fi system. And short and sharp too, it's only 85 minutes. Yeah, that was the era when they didn't go too long. Short, sharp, classic, mm. enjoyable. A very enjoyable. Watch it. Get an old VHS yeah, player. Get an old VHS player, find and, a uh, rip. If you have to watch it on DVD, just watch it and knowing that you don't get to see. Plug your TV in through the RCA connections, not the HDMI, and you'll get. No, you'll get the quality, but you won't get the waiter. Quality. Oh, you won't get the waiter. Mm. Hmm? Can you tell us the way to the cult's headquarters? Oh, I'm sorry, I don't know. <laughs> All right. 
Thanks for watching this episode of Below the Title. If you'd like to see more, please like and subscribe. And don't forget to click that little notification so you know when we deliver more of this gold.